Morning everybody, it is 11 o'clock and it is absolutely freezing today. My little uh, weather thing on my iPhone said 19 degrees this morning, let's see what it says now. But because it's so windy, it um, it's in the d single digits. The wind chill is making it feel like it's in the single digits. Pete took Roxy out and he said she literally did the fastest wee in history and ran for the door. It is cold. Let's see what it says now. Yeah, it still says 19 and with a high of 25. Tomorrow, 16 with a high of 25, 25, 27, 27, 28. And apparently some kind of snow accumulations on Friday. The snow yesterday was absolutely nothing. Just ended up being flurries on and off. It is cold. I have to run to the bank just to do a quick deposit and come back. And I don't even want to go out. I'm afraid. <laughs> I just showered. I've got my scarf around my neck because I got the chills. Um, Asha's just gotten ready. She's got work later on today. But uh, she doesn't have to leave and for another couple of hours, I don't think. She got a text this morning saying, can you come in early while she was in the shower? But by the time she got out of the shower, they'd already found someone. So that was good. She was pleased about that. But, yep, I'm going to run to the bank. I will maybe talk to you while I'm out driving. It's actually a bright day. You wouldn't believe it was so cold, but you can just hear. It sounds like a train going by every now and again, but it's actually the wind. Um, so I'll talk to you guys in a little. I hope you're having a good Tuesday so far. I want to keep saying Monday, because yesterday was a holiday, holiday and everything was closed. I feel like today is Monday, so I'm all out of sorts, very confused, which is easy to do this day these days. So I'll talk to you in a bit. Bye guys. I'll give you a little ride going down the street. It is quite empty. Yesterday everybody was home. On both sides of the street was packed. Okay. So just driving, driving. Looks beautiful out, doesn't it? You wouldn't know it was freezing unless you actually could feel it. Trust me on this one. It's frigid. Oh, I can't like coming out this time of day. It's quiet. Go straight down that road to come to the highway and then you get to go to the malls. <laughs> this way we're just going into, not going downtown, we're just going to this little shopping centre where my bank is. And I'm going to run through the drive through Turn you off at the intersection though because police men come through here quite often. Look, see how cold it is that poor guy doing the gas. And our gas. 3.99 and let it come down a little bit. It was over four. Uh, we'll see in a bit. This is the time to come, guys. It is absolutely dead around here. Did I miss something, or is everyone just home because it's cold? So we're heading to the drive-through. Going through the drive-through. Okay, guys, that was really, really quick. That was great. Two seconds. So now I'm heading home already. I have nothing else I need to do except work at home and um, have people pull out in front of me. There we go. But, um, see you in a little bit. This little garage here is um, a place to be whenever there is a football game, basketball game or whatever game. That's the place to be. They sit outside there all summer. Looks like a little cafe. And they have a TV in the garage. And it is makes me laugh every time. I'm like, there's someone enjoying their home and enjoying life. And uh, yeah, any sporting event, they're out there. Summer, winter, spring, fall, you know. It's a little after seven. Pete got home about a half hour ago and Ash got home, even though she's left already. She's gone over to Alex's. Um, oh, the door just opened. Roxy went out, I thought she was coming in. 
She, one minute she's sitting there watching me and the next minute she disappears, she's had enough. But I didn't even hear her get up, so I just saw the door open and it's a little dark in the hallway. Um, it's freezing. It's been cold all day and the weatherman said we're in a deep freeze for the week. It's the, it's the coldest it's been for this time of year in years, so we're not going to see any ending sight, not at least till the weekend. <laughs> that would be an end, but they're not promising. But it's been like 19 degrees all day today. It's been really windy on top of it, so it's been bitter, bitter cold. The heat's working overtime in the house. Um, I don't have Katie tomorrow. We're supposed to have her tomorrow, but they wanted to switch to Thursday. But I, unfortunately, well, fortunately for Ash, um, fortunately for them, I can't because I promised Ash we would go to the outlets, and I'm not going to break my promise because we've been trying to go since the beginning of December, and that isn't right to do it again. <laughs> Roxy just came back, and she's taken pride of place on the seat. Here in that case, I just love, she looks up at me like, who are you talking to? So, yeah, I won't have Katie again till Friday, so Ash and I are going to go to the outlet. Well, that was a big jump, Rox, on Thursday. And even though it's this cold and they're outdoor outlets, we will just go to a few and then come back. And then I feel I've at least kept my promise. And then they asked if I could have Katie Tuesday through Friday next week. So um, I will see her next week for an extra day. Um, so I'm going to go figure out something for dinner. I'm just going to have leftovers. I have half my sandwich from yesterday and some quesadilla pieces left. So I'm just going to get the panini maker going and throw them in there and eat something. Whichever I don't, Pete will have or he's having chili, I'm not sure. It's one of those days when a stew would be good, but I don't have any beef or uh, a chili. But I'm not really a chili fan, but Pete is, so he'll have his chili. Or spaghetti and something like that. It's just one of those cold to your bone days. I had a sweater on, a t-shirt on, a tank top on, and a hoodie on top today. It was that cold. And like I said, I thought the heat had gone out again because I got really cold when Katie was here. But I felt the radiator, it was lukewarm. But I turned the heat down. I don't know when I did that. So probably froze everybody out of the house today. So I put a bunch more of the kids orders in and I will finish those. So one minute they say we're gonna get really a lot and then sometimes we're not really getting too much. You hear the expression, it's too cold to snow. Pete thinks I'm mad every time I say that. I've said to him many, many times, it's too cold to snow. And he's like, how could it be too cold to snow? It's ice, but it can be too cold to snow. Sorry, something weird was just on TV then. Anybody watch The Housewives of Atlanta? The Real Housewives of Atlanta? They're doing a video and I think that was a big bum on there for the set, not a real one, obviously. So, I'm gonna go get something to eat and if anything exciting happens I'll come say hello but it's been one of those days where it was just errands and it's cold and if I keep going on you're gonna think I'm whinging about the cold but it's really cold um, good to just do nothing today I didn't do nothing I worked in the office but I mean I didn't actually really have to go anywhere except the bank this morning so I did want to go get some Greek yogurt though um, I've seen like these, they almost look like half and half containers with this Greek yogurt and I wanted to try it because everyone's saying how good it is but I can't even remember what the name of it is. So I'll run over to the grocery store tomorrow and see if I can find it and try it. Maybe make some smoothies in the blender. Um, Alrighty, well I'll check in with you guys soon. Hope everyone had a good day, whatever you did. I don't, I think it snowed again in England today, didn't it? Um, I saw something like dates from the Express and Star back home and I think from what I can tell it snowed in the Midlands again today so I definitely have to give mum a call in the morning. I meant to call her today but by the time Katie left it was too late and I had her so many days last week and then we were pretty much in and out all weekend working Saturday and then so I will try giving you a call tomorrow mum if you see this before I call you but actually you probably won't because I'm going to try and call you in the morning. I get back around 11.30, so I'll try and give you a ring, see how you're doing. Guys, well, we just had dinner. Pete had the rest of my gyro sandwich, and I had a couple of pieces of uh, quesadilla 
from the other night and it was good just threw it in the panini maker heated it up and uh, it was just as good as the night I had it so it's eight o'clock and um, I know nothing else is exciting and I can't remember what I was going to tell you guys so maybe I'll remember tomorrow and I hope everyone's keeping warm and if the snow is coming your way stay safe only go out if you have to and I will talk to you later have a good one guys bye bye